Bikini Bottom is full of sinister secrets, but nothing is more disturbing than the shocking truth about snails. This is Bikini Bottom Mysteries. You've seen some suspicious fishes, but none of their plots can compare to the snail crisis. Haven't heard of it? Not surprising, because everyone has turned a blind eye to the strange fates of countless snails. Exhibit A, the strays. Gary the snails got it all. Plenty of snail poe. Weekly baths. And a pair of stylish wingtips. But it seems most snails aren't so lucky. Most snails' owners seem completely inattentive. Even negligent. And those are just the snails who have owners. Are you a stray? Wondering why this pet store owner instantly assumes Gary's a stray? It's probably because Bikini Bottom is overrun with stray snails. Gangs of feral gastropods roved the streets, scavenging for nachos. Guess he didn't like nachos. And wreaking havoc on local business owners. But the strays may be the lucky ones. Because while some snails take to the streets, others vanish entirely. Exhibit B, disappearances. Meet Snelly, the purebred snail. Wow, a snail made out of bread. Snelly cost nearly two grand. Which cost me $1,700. She came with her own certificate of pedigree, and she was a near champion in the sport of kings. And what a beautiful day for the sport of kings, of which I am a huge fan. But purebred pedigreed Snelly, the hopeless romantic, the $1,700 snail, lost just one race and was never seen again. And isn't it time someone asked what happened to Larry the Snail? Come on, let me show you around. Gary's grumpy replacement built a life for himself in his new home. But when Gary returned, what happened to Larry? He vanished. Think there was an ocean-wide search for Larry? A heart-rending ballad? Skywriting? Think again. No, Larry disappeared with no tears shed and no questions asked, and he wouldn't be the last snail. Consider the case of Jerry. And Gary and Larry are real different than Jerry. Does he actually live in SpongeBob's pocket day in and day out? Or could he be counted among the missing? And remember, Annette? No, that's Snelly again. N no, no, that's Mary. Right, she was Mrs. Puff's supposedly beloved pet. <laughs> since I was a little girl. But Annette was rescued from a tree. Gotcha! And then disappeared without a trace. Thank you, Birdman! No sign of her anywhere in Mrs. Puff's house. Not here. Or here. Or even here. Just one photo, a single photo of a dearly loved pet who completely vanished with no search, no explanation. Did these indoor snails leave their old lives behind to join a roving gang of strays? Or is something more sinister going on here? Exhibit C, the shells. Snelly, Larry, Jerry, Annette. Is there anything these vanished snails leave behind? Any sign of their existence? Just one. They're shells. Yes, a heap of broken, empty shells was discovered in one Las Vegas home. But it's just the tip of the iceberg. Because there's evidence of a whole stockpile of shells hiding in plain sight. You come on down to Angry Jack's Shell Emporium. Angry Jack's. A whole warehouse of refurbished shells, taken from their snails and shined up for sale. And for a pretty penny, too. And for the affordable price of just 95 95 95 Selling refurbished shells seems harmless, until you consider that snails are born with their shells and never leave them. So each of those shells must have been grown by a snail. But while the shells are still around... There she is. What happened to the snails inside them? <coughs> so many shells, so few pet snails. Something's not adding up. Or maybe it's adding up perfectly. We may never get to the bottom of the snail crisis, but one thing's for sure, 
there's something slimy going on in Bikini Bottom. And now, a Bikini Bottom bonus mystery. Welcome to Bikini Bottom's most exclusive club, the Magic Conch Club. Praise the Magic Conch! These devotees of the Magic Conch shell always consult the wisdom of the conch. The shell knows all! But how is the Magic Conch's advice always 100% right? How could it know that a feast would fall right out of the sky? That doing nothing was the key to survival. Nothing. Is this plastic pull-string conch calculating every possible outcome? Is it just dumb luck? Or could it actually have mystical powers? Oh, oh hell, hell, the, the magic, magic conch. conch! Will the secrets of the magic conch ever be revealed? No. File this one under... Oh. Four... Oh. Have you seen something strange under the sea? Leave us a comment and tune in next time for more investigations that will blow your pores, strip your scales, and flip your fins. Like, follow, and remember, if the pineapple fits, live in it. <laughs>